Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Teacher, oh. good evening. Good evening, Mario. How are you today? I feel better without ah, the okay. discomfort of fever, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, Chris. Griselda, hello. Jorge is listener today, right? Hello. Marlon, Brian, welcome, everybody. Now let's begin. Let's begin with the class. Okay. Here we have the use of possessive. We're going to start review. And this class is only to review and to practice. Right? Ahorita les comparto. Give me a second. Review and practice, right? Repaso y práctica. Review and practice. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's start with the possessive. Listen, please. Page three, exercise three. Grammar focus. My, your, his, her. What's your name? My name is Taylor. What's his name? His name is Michael. What's her name? Her name is Jennifer. What's equals what is. Good. Now, what is your name? Marcela, what? Marcela, what is your name? Marcela? My name is Marcela Carillas. It's a pleasure. Good. And then, Marcela, here we have Mario. Can you see Mario? Yes. What's your name? My name is Mario Olano. Uh -huh. uh, Marcela, what is his name? Uh, his name Mario. His name is Mario. Very good. And we have also, uh, we have also, well, maybe it's walking, but let me see. Anybody else? Uh, on the girl, right? Let me see. Okay, give me a second. Okay, uh, okay, we have Griselda, right? Uh, ask Marcela, ask Gris Griselda her name. What's your name, say? What's your name? No, what's your name, say, to Griselda? What's your name? Uh, what's your name? My name is Marcela. Ah, uh, Griselda, what is her name? Her name is Marcella. Good. So my name is personal, right? His name is for a woman, for a man, sorry. And her name is for a for a woman, right? Okay, good. Now look at these examples. Look at this example. Oh, I have two messages. I can ah. I'm sorry, Marlon. Marlon no no escucha dice. Está lloviendo por ahí, Marlon. Espero que no, ¿verdad? Que lo del huracán, pues, ha traído nuevas lluvias, ¿verdad? Pero esperamos que no esté lloviendo por ahí. Ok, good. Look at this. Uh, here we have this conversation. We have Nicole, Antonio, and then we have Antonio and Nicole. Talking about this man and this woman, right? So look at this. It says, hello, what's your name? And then he said, hi. Hi. My, your, or his? My name is. My name, right? My name is Toñito. And what's your name? Your name, right? And then my name is Nicole. My name is Nicole, right? Then we will have this other conversation and we talk about a man. For me, it's your name, my name. For he is his name and for she is her name, right? 
Uh, it's raining. Oh, good. Give me a second, please. Give me a second. Quiero notar los listeners esta noche. Sí, Saúl. And Jorge, right? Jorge Alberto Orellana. Ok. Y Marlon, pues que ya no nos escucha ahorita, ¿verdad? Pero espero que más ratito deje de ver. Ok, good. So, what's his or her name? For the man. His. His, because it's a man, right? We say his name. What's his name? And then? His name is? <clears throat> his name is? Michael. Michael. And what? It refers to the woman of purple. Purple blouse. What's his, her, or my? What's her name? Her name. Her name. Her name. Her name. Okie dokie. And then? Jenny person, right? So? His, her, or my? Her. Her name. Good. Now listen, please. Conversation one. Hello, what's your name? Hi, my name is Antonio. What's your name? My name is Nicole. Now, please, repeat after me. Hello? What's your name? Name. Hi. My name is Antonio. What's your name? My name is Nicole. Good. Now we're going to practice this conversation. But we're going to make a substitution. Don't say my name is Antonio. My name is Otmar, right? And what's your name? My name is Mario, right? So Mario and Otmar, please. Mario, your letter A. And Otmar, your letter B. Action. Hello, what's your name? Hi, my name is Otmar. What's your name? My name is Mario. Good. Thank you very much. Now... Repeat the conversation, conversation uh, two, but in this case, we're going to refer to Marcela and Marcela and Ernesto. Marcela and Ernesto, right? Ready, Mario and Otmar? Mario, your A, and Otmar, again, your B. But refer to Ernesto and Marcela, right? But his name. So, sorry, sorry, excuse me. In this case, you are the model, Marcela. Usted es la okay. modelo. <laughs> Ernesto y, y Marcela son los modelos ahí, ok. <laughs> Usted es quietecito ahí, <laughs> ok. So, Mario and Otmar, please. Mario, your A. And Otmar, B. Mario, ready? Yes. Uh, what, is, oh, what is his name? Okay. Sorry, excuse me, because a confusion of name, right? Nos confundimos con los nombres. Perdón, perdón. Que... Yes. Va vamos a hacerlo así. Mario Neftalí y Otmar nos van a hacer la conversación, pero los modelos van a ser Marcela y Mario Ernesto. ¿Yes? Así que Mario Ernesto, quietecito ahí modelando, ¿verdad? <ríe> y Marcela también. ¿Ready, Mario? Mario Neftalí, your A. Ready, teacher. Ok, now, action. Uh, what's his name? His name is Mario Ernesto. And what's his name? Her, her. What's her name? Her name is Marcela. Okay, thank you very much, right? Okay, para que, Mar para que Mario Ernesto no se quede picado, vamos a hacer una conversación con él también, ¿verdad? Eh, ¿Me va a ayudar Griselda? Yes. And Ernesto, right? And we are going to use Otmar 
en Marcela, too, right? The models. Los modelos van a ser Otmar en Marcela, ¿ok? Freddy Ernesto, Mario Ernesto en Griselda. Ok. Ready. Go ahead. What's his name? His name is Mario. Otmar, Otmar. Otmar. His name is Otmar. And what's his name? Um, her name is Marcela. Marcela. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's not the same uh, uh, virtual, right? No, no es lo mismo la conversación virtual que estar en un salón de clase. Por eso está algo confuso. Pero ya creo que lo hicimos bien. Okay. Good. Now let's continue, right? Now we're going to review the alphabet. We're going to review the alphabet. <laughs> The last time, listen, please. Page three, exercise four, spelling names. Part A, listen and practice. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay, with this information, class, we are going to go to the manual. And, sorry, give me a second here. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, let me open the book for you, right? Okay, here I have the alphabet, right? Now let me share with you. Okay, page number uh, 15. 15, right? The alphabet. We already practiced the alphabet. And now we are going to make an exercise. Ready? I need to copy in your notebook 1 to 12. So copy one, two, three, four, five, six to 12, right? Ready? Copy, please. Copy. One to 12. Copy. One to 12, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, 11, 12. Okay. Then I will dictate, dictation, dictation, right? And in number one, for example, I have two letters. I have the M and the D. But the teacher, me, is going to tell you only one letter. Not the two letters, only one. Example, right? If I say M, so you copy number one, letter M. Or if the teacher says D, so you copy letter D. Okay? Understand? Okay. Finish, finish, 1 to 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 11, 12, right? Okay, number one, ready? D. Copy, copy. Number two, B. B. R. Z.
x p d A. U. I. J. Okay. One volunteer, please. To read the 12 letters, one volunteer. Yes, teacher. Okay, Mario. Okay. Uh, G, B, B, R, Z. Wait, wait, wait a minute, Mario. Mario, sorry, give me a second. Start with number one. Number one, what letter is? D. D, correct. Continue. Two. B. B, yes. No, number two is not because we have B, B. and V. Ah, V. B. Okay. B. B. I will copy. I will copy. Give me a second. Okay, I will copy what Mario said, right? Uh huh. Continue, Mario. Uh, B. R <clears throat> Z X T D A U Me? U me. I'm kidding, Mario. <laughs> okay, continue. 11. I. J. Okay. Cling. Totally correct, right? So I don't see problem with the alphabet, right? No veo problemas con el alfabeto. Veo que a todos lo aprendimos. Okay, congratulations, everybody. Congratulations. Yes. Good. Now let's continue. Okay. These are the possessive adjectives, right? My, your, his, her, its, our, their. Possessive adjectives. And possessive nouns are our teacher's name, Pedro's address, Melissa and Dora's last name. So remember that when we use the apostrophe and the S, we use possession, right, with the noun. We can use common and proper nouns. And if we have some plurals, uh, for example, we say Mario, Griselda, and Otmar. So we copy the, uh, the apostrophe, sorry, and the S in the last noun. So we can say Mario, Griselda and Otmar's class, right? Okay, good. Now we're going to say some information, right? But I will take the attendance before we start with this exercise. Uh, Ana Maria? Brian Andres? Claudia Mabel? Present. Thank you. Chris? Thank you. Thank you. Daisy? Present. Welcome, Daisy. Edwin Alexander? Dagoberto? Gamaliel? Glenda? Present. Griselda. Present. 
Jorge, Jorge Arellana, ya le tomé la asistencia. Jorge. Ok, good. José Liceo. José Armando. José. Juan Carlos Mendoza. Carolina Zelaya. Present. Welcome, Carolina. Marcela. Present teacher. Thank you. Ernesto. Present teacher. Mario. Present teacher. Marlon. Present teacher. Ya no se escucha mejor, Mario. Eh, a Marlon, sorry, Marlon. Sí, tuve que abandonar la reunión. Ah, bueno. Me agrada que prefiera la clase de inglés. Thank you. <ríe> ok, thank you, Marlon. Good. Eh, Martin. Martin, sorry. Martin. Eh, maybe. Present. Thank you, maybe. Otmar. Present. Sa Saúl, ya le tomé la asistencia, ¿verdad? De oyente, ahora. ¿Y Jansi? Present. Thank you, Jansi. Welcome. Good. Eh, Ana María. Brian. Dagoberto. Present, teacher. Ah, ok. Present. Eh, Dagoberto. En Brian, Brian. Present. Yes, ok. Thank you, Brian. Eh, José Armando. Okay, good. Let's continue, right? Now, your teacher's name. It says, as a partner to spell the following information and write it in the spaces, use capital letters for proper noun. Good. So what are you going to do? You're going to say, what's your teacher's name? I will copy for you. Look. What's your teacher's name, right? And then you say, how do you spell that? Okay, let's just start with the first one, right? Uh, Brian? To Claudia, please. Brian, to Claudia. Please. Say, what's your teacher's name? Uh, I don't see the camera, Brian, Francisco. Uh, Saúl, bueno, Saúl y Jorge porque están oyentes, ¿verdad? Brian, eh, funciona su cámara. Brian. Ok. Nos copia, Brian. Ah, por ahí estamos. Excelentoso, Brian. Thank Perfecto. you. Yes, no problem, Brian. Eh, no, no problem. Claudia, can you hear? ¿Nos escucha, Claudia? No, ok. Sí. So, yes, sí, sí, okay. sí, sí. Yes, ok. So, Brian is going to make you a question. Brian le va a preguntar algo. ¿Ready? Ok, Brian. Uh, what's your teacher name? Claudia. Le vamos a poner de castigo que nos traiga semita a todos, Claudia. Vamos a ver si no se acuerda de mi nombre. Vamos a ver. Javier. Javier. Eh, yo creo que sería entonces la respuesta a la uno. Javier, what? Javier Hernández, Javier Pérez. Javier. Vale, le voy a dar una pista. Soy primo de Marlon. No puede ser. Pero lo voy a buscar. Qué pena, no, Claudia. Gómez. Gómez. Qué Gómez. Vaya, Javier Brian. Gómez. Yes. Now, Brian, ya le contestaron. Ahora dígale. How do you spell that? How 
Okay. How do you spell that? Okay. Uh -huh, Claudia. Mm -hmm. Spell is A, B, C, D. How do, oh. you, how do you spell Claudia? C-L-A-U-D-I-A. -A. Orellana. O Pero sería el del teacher, ¿verdad? Yes, me, my, my, my name. Uh -huh. G? No, G. Oh. J, 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 J. J. No. Ah, continue, continue. J. Yay. A. B. I. E. I. 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 yo. R. R, right, R. 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 Mm. Okay, continue, R. Claudia, continue. G. O. M. E. C. Good, thank you very much, right? Thank you, Brian, thank you, Claudia. Now, Chris and Daisy. Chris, you make the question number two. What's your classmate's name, right? And then, okay. and then uh, Daisy is going to choose uh, other name. For example, uh, Glenda, Maris, Marcela, Josue, Carolina, Ernesto, Mario, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, right? Right. I start the beginning number two. Number two, please, yes. Okay. Your classmate's name. What? Oh, sorry. What's your name? No, no, no. Wait, wait, What's wait. What's your teacher's name? Wait, wait, wait. Wait a minute. Number one is, what's your teacher name? Number two is, what's your classmate name? You know, Christian, what is a classmate? For example, Brian Orellana is your classmate. Claudia Mabel Orellana is your classmate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Classmate, classmate. Okay, good. What's your... Bueno, vamos a sustituir eso aquí para que me entienda bien, Chris. Give me a second, Chris. What's your classmate name? Okay? Okay. Good, now. Ready? Ready. What's your classmate name? You can choose whatever. Uh, Daisy, puedes coger cualquier compañero ahí. Okay. Claudia, your classmate name. Her name? <laughs> Her name is? Her name is Claudia. Mabel Orellana. Claudia Orellana. Okay, good. Now, Chris, make the question. How do you spell that? How do you spell that? Uh, they, they see. How do you spell that? Uh, I got to spell uh, the. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. You're making the question. Usted le está preguntando a Daisy. Que le diga un nombre okay. de un compañero. Y ella, ella dijo Claudio Orellana, right? Ahora pregúntele usted cómo lo deletrea. How do you spell that? How do you spell that? Ajá, uh -huh, Daisy. Claudio Orellana, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Hasta el apellido. Yes. <laughs> ok. C. L. A. 
U B A A S I verdad no I A O R R R R R I L L A M A Good, Claudia Orellana. Thank you, thank you very much, right? Now, uh, I will make questions. Who's next? After Daisy, we have um, Dagoberto, right? Dagoberto. Uh, I need you to help me with a classmate. In this case, Dagoberto, you're going to make the question to Glenda. Ready, Dagoberto? Estoy con oyente, permita. Ah, ok, good. No, entonces, sí. Tranquilo, no se preocupe, ahorita le pongo de ella. Bueno. Tranquilo. Dagoberto, ok, good. Me parece que hay una reunión por ahí, no. Bueno. Ok, Glenda. Sí. Uh, you make the question to Griselda, Glenda. You make the question to, Gris, to Griselda, okay? Now, hello, Glenda. What's your classmate's occupation? What does, hello. Your, what does your classmate do? Glenda? Le vamos a ayudar con la pregunta para, para que no me ande tan, tan extraviada. ¿Cómo preguntarle a alguien qué es lo que hace, right? So the question is... Pero le pregunto a Griselda, ¿verdad? Yes, to Griselda, yes. Uh, what, what do you do? What do you do? Uh, oh, you can say, what's your occupation? Okay, you can make this, right? So, Glenda to Griselda. Hello, Griselda. What do you do, occupation? No, what do you do? What do you do? Okay. Hello, Griselda. Hello. What do you do? Hello, Glenda. I am an assistant opponent. Griselda. Hello, Linda. Hello. I am an assistant at Poland. Okay, so Glenda, what does Griselda do? Assistant de cobros, le entendí. No. Assistant accountant, right, Griselda? Assistant accountant. Okay, assistant hello. accountant. Como es muy largo, Glenda, le voy a ayudar. ¿O, está, o quiere decirlo todito? ¿Se lo puede, Glenda? Va, vamos a hacer algo. Lo voy a copiar y después me lo dicto esto solito, ¿ok? Ok. Vamos a ver. Assistant Accountant. Assistant Accountant, right? Ok, only you. So, Glenda, what does Griselda do? Cheese. Uh, I. No, cheese. Is, no, wait, cheese, wait, wait. Cheese, assistant accountant. An assistant accountant. Okay, now, Glenda, how do you spell that? How do you spell that? A. S. S. I. T. T. Assist, assistant. A-S-S-I-T. -S S. T. T. I
en hey, correcto <ríe> okay sí en, en perdón en sí 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 Accountant, accountant. Ah, con A, C, O. C, C. C, C, O, O. U, U, U. T. N, N. P. Accountant. A N T. Okay, Glenda. <laughs> assistant accountant. Okay. What does Griselda do? She's an assistant accountant. Okay, good. Now let me see. Thank you very much, Glenda. Thank you, Griselda. Eh, let me see. Hey, Carolina, please. Carolina, you're going to ask Marcela. Ready, Carolina? Okay. Good. Eh, Carolina, what ah. is your classmate last name? What is a classmate last name? Mm -hmm. What is Marcela's last name? Okay. Marcela. Ah, okay. What is a classmate like Marcela? No. What is no. your? What is your? Ah, what, what is your a classmate like me, Marcela? No. No, no, no. What is your last name? Ah, ¿cuál es mi? Hmm. What is your? Your. Your class name. El, el, el apellido de Marcela, right? Ajá. Yes. Oh, déme un segundo que no sé. Aquí no miro. ¿Dónde está Marcela? Carías. Hola. Yes, Marcela Carías Hernández. Ok. Uh, Carías. But, but you have to ask her, right? Pero tiene que preguntarle a Marcela. Ah, ok. Ah. <laughs> Entonces, what is your a class? No, no, a class. La, no, ya no, no. Ya no, cuando usted dice your, ya está, ya está dirigiendo la pregunta. A ella, a mí se lo Okay, good. Okay. What is your last name, Marcela? Ajá, Marcela. No, no se escucha. Last name, Carías. Uh -huh. Okay, good. Now, Carolina, what, My is, last name. what okay. is her last name? What is le, la... No, I ask you. Yo le estoy preguntando a usted, Carolina. Okay. What is Marcela's last name? Carías. How do you spell that? Okay. C, C, A, R, A, I, A, S. Congratulations, right? Career, right? Yes. Good. Now, I will make questions to the next student. Thank you, eh, Carolina. Chris and Carolina, thank you. And thank you, Marcela. Now, Ernesto. I will make the question to you, Ernesto. Ready? What's your teacher's name? Uh, his, his name uh, Javier Gomez. How do you spell that? Is uh, J. 
E, B, no, 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 J, J, I, I, B, no, es J, J, A, B, I, eh, I, R, J, G, 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 O, M, I, Z. Good. The second one, Ernesto. What's your classmate name? Eh, Number two. Eh, is a Marcel? No, no, Claudia. Claudia Ariana. Okay, good. How do you spell that, Ernesto? Es C L I -E U D I -A. C L. Wait, Ernesto. C L C L A -E U D I -A. Continuo. O R I L L A N A. Good. Thank you, Ernesto. Thank you very much. Difficult, right? Congratulations, Difficult. Ernesto. Very good. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> okay, Mario. What is your classmate occupation, Mario? I am a teacher. No, no. Your classmate occupation. No, no your occupation. No, your classmate's occupation. Griselda's occupation, yes. right? Ah, she, she's, a, she's an assistant and an accountant. Good. How do you spell that? Uh, uh, a S S I S T A N T uh, A C C O U N T A N T. Okie dokie. Number four. What is your classmate's last name? What is Marcela's? Last name, in other words. Her last name is Carillas. How do you spell that? Uh, C A R I A S. S. Okie dokie. Thank you very much, right? Thank you very much. The alphabet is absolutely necessary, right? Very good, Mario. Congratulations. Yeah. Good. Let's continue, right? Let's continue. Good. Now we are going to complete this information, right? Everybody is going to complete. What is your first name? What is your middle name? Your last name, your occupation, your boss name, and your workplace, right? For example, I will copy mine. Look, the example, the example of the teacher. Teacher, excuse me. Yes. Middle name is like a second name. Yeah, I will explain. Look, my first name is Jose. Jose, right? My middle name is Javier. My last name is Gomez. My occupation, I'm a teacher. My boss name is Francisco. My workplace is uh, uh, Inglés Corporativo, but I work in also in Miner, right? Miner. 
In the morning, I work in Mined. At the night, I work with Inglés Corporativo. So this is my first, my personal information. Now, what about you? Copy, copy, please. Copy. Aprovecho el comercial. Eh, el domingo revisé la plataforma. Bueno, no sé si ahora la terminaron, pero el domingo me parecía todavía que me faltaban eh, Brian Andrés, Daisy, eh, Mario, Mario Nestalí. De verdad, Chicho. Sí, no sé si, si, si ya lo terminó, Mario, pero el, el domingo que revisé todavía no estaba completado. Lo que no podía pasar del 4 en adelante, teacher. Ah, okay. Pero corregí lo que usted me había dicho con la cosita del apóstrofe. Lo, lo ajá, pero, ajá, Mario, pero esa era la unidad 2 y la unidad 1 sí ya la había terminado. Sí, la, la, quizás no la marqué, pero, pero sí la había terminado. La terminó, Baje, no importa, ya lo vamos a revisar, no se preocupe ahí. Ok, y si no mañana, me indica, teacher, por favor. Yo le voy a revisar, le, le mando al WhatsApp mañana, oiga, para. Gracias. Sí, ok, good. Now ready? Good. I will continue with. Eh, with Dagoberto, right? Dagoberto. Right. So, what's your first name? My first name is Francisco. What is your middle name? My middle name is Dagoberto. And what is your last name? My last name is Monteagudo. And what is your occupation? Dagoberto. My occupation is Seller. Seller, right? Seller. Well, we're going to say a salesperson, right? Salesperson. Salesperson. And what is your boss's boss's name? Boss's name. Your manager. The name of your manager, right? Uh, Dago. Nombre de su jefe. Mr. Estrada. Me, me he salido, perdón. Ah, ok. No. Este, eh, my Estrada. boss name is Ulvier Estrada. Ah. Ul... Sorry. Ulvier. Ulvier. Something like that, right? Estrada. Sí. Ok, thank you. And what is your workplace? Where do you work? Eh, laboratorio en FASA. Laboratorio en FASA, right? I suppose, right? Like this, <laughs> in FASA. Good. Thank you very much. Now, next student, please. Uh, Mar yes? Excuse me. Yes, please. What happens if the person have uh, three names? Mm. Well, it's not common in the United States, but you can say, for example, what is your third name? ¿Cuál es su tercer nombre? Maybe. It's a possibility, but in fact, in the United States, they only manage just two names. En realidad, en Estados Unidos, bueno, en la mayoría de países que se habla inglés, Inglaterra inclusive, solo se maneja un nombre y un apellido. Eh, como referencia también se puede decir un middle name, pero un tercer nombre es muy poco común. 
Pero si así fuera, sería eh, your third name. Yes. Sería algo muy poco común, en, especialmente en Europa y en Estados Unidos. Pero podríamos decir, what's your third name? ¿Cuál es tu, su tercer nombre? Right? Yes. Thank you. Eh, I suppose, pero le repito, no es, nada, no es algo común. Sí, está bien. En, el, eh, en, pero, en los perdón, países del, la, latinoamericanos sí es bien común, hasta cuatro he visto yo. Tengo una, sí, bueno, una, una compañera uh, que tiene cuatro nombres. Yes. Sí, pero es prohibido por la ley del nombre de la persona natural. Correcto, no, sí, no, sí, Dos you nombres y apellidos, sí. Yes. It's true, correct. Yes, okay, yeah. let's continue. Now, Teacher, eh, um, one more question. Yes, come on, go, go. I like questions. Me gustan las preguntas. Come on, uh, go ahead. With the homeworks, uh, mm -hmm. every day, uh, we, we got to do one homework. And every homework have a number. Uh -huh. My question is... Um, What's number of homework uh, for today? Yeah. For today's number five. Number five. five. Yeah. Okay. Because this class is number five. Yeah. Um, so today um, we, we finish with unit number one. Unit one, goodbye. Today we finish. Unit one, finish. I, I found a, a mistake in a one homework. Oh. Can we check it right now if you want? ¿Cree que lo podemos re revisar juntos? Sure. Yes. Uh, okay, no problem. I will send you the picture before. No, no problem. I will, let's do it right now. Let me see. Okay. Let me see. Okay. Here. Ahorita estamos abriéndolo. La plataforma, yes. De una sola vez revisamos los. Los. Demás ejercicios, right? Eh, plataforma. Here. It's opening. Ok. In this homework, the options. Uh... Ah, oh. <laughs> yeah, I see the picture. Have a different options, but uh -huh. the action is only three. Wake uh, up, but... uh, selling and uh, shower. Um, yeah, but... the, the, the homework, you can read another options. And you can see into the pictures. I understand. So there is a mistake, right? The yep. picture and the answer, right? Hay un error entre el dibujo y la, la acción. Ok, but yep. let, let's do it together. Let, let's do it together. Eh, si, si gusta, me deja compartir. Para mostrarles la pantalla ahí. Ok, thank you very much. Ahora sí les voy a compartir. Let me see. Ok. Remember is unit number one, right? In unit number one, we have get to know someone. It says five questions, right? So the first one is, this is the number one, look. Michelle, R, Michelle A is, or Michelle is a floor manager. Is A. Is A, right? Vamos a tomar esta. No, no quiero darle copia a todos, pero vamos a tomar esta. <laughs> okay, good. And then we, we have one option, right? Terminamos con una opción. Yes, good. This is class number one. Class number two. Okay, bird to be. Is she Rebecca? Yes, she. Yes, she is, right? And then. You, Miguel, and Ricardo, etc., etc., right? So you take only one option. Good. Number three. What letter come before the Q? Antes de la, de la Q. What letter come before the Q? Sí. Oh. 
Oh. No. no. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Marlo. That was sorry. Okay, so we finished with this, right? How many letters are in the English alphabet? Which are the vowels? Which letter is next? A, B, C. Which letter is between I and K? Esa no la había visto, teacher. Yo me la solté. Ah, okay. That's why. Ya vio de este el error. Sí, es que se lo dio hacer los ejercicios de la unidad uno. No, es que le di siguiente y yo pensé que era que era el siguiente la siguiente tarea y quizás me fui para adelante por eso es que nunca me me salía oh, yeah. porque no vi el cuatro y el cinco. Ok, eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Mire, tarea uno la terminamos y le damos marcar esta página, ¿ve? Clean ya me aparece terminada. Tarea dos marcar página, clean. Tarea tres marcar página, clean. Y tarea cuatro marcar página, ¿eh? Good. La tarea 4 dice, his name is Claudia. Right or wrong? ¿Esto está correcto o incorrecto? Wrong. Wrong, right? Ahí estamos. Le estamos dando copia, ¿eh? <ríe> ok. Your students are nice. Right or wrong? My name, my, ne, my ne, name is Julia. <ríe> correcto o incorrecto? Good. Y esta es la tarea 5, yes? Good. Instruction. My boss are el menargueta. ¿Cuál es el error aquí? Aquí uno de estos tres es la corrección de la oración. Yes. Nadie en Rita is the new teachers. Hay un error ahí, ¿no? Entonces hay que corregirlo. Uno de los tres. Ok. Esta, hora, esta tarea, la tarea 5, es la que van a hacer esta noche. Yes. O, por cuestiones de INSAFOR, son las la que tuvieron que haber hecho el viernes. ¿Sí? Porque vamos cada viernes. Pero, en teoría, tendría que haber sido esta noche. ¿no? Pero, ya vi que la mayoría logró terminar las cinco tareas, así que no hay problema. Ok. Luego nos vamos al curso. Let's go to the course. Section number two. Daily routines. Este lo vamos a empezar a ver mañana. Tomorrow. You need to tomorrow. Task number six. Clase número seis. La clase de mañana. You know? Class number six. Good. Por aquí es donde va Mario ahorita. ¿eh? Yes. <ríe> en la clase de mañana va Mario. Súper ah, perdido, teacher. No, no. Pero, <ríe> pero ya no ubicamos, Mario. Yes. Con el presente simple, ¿verdad? Entonces aquí es de ordenar. Y podría decir, I sleep. At night. Ponemos punto. No ponemos más de un espacio porque si no nos va a salir mal. Vamos a ver si me salió bien a mí. ¡Tarán! Vaya, ven que así es. ¿ve? Yes. Pero por cuestiones de, de no dar copia, pues voy a, voy a corregirlo. Tío. Ok, es de ir ordenando, ¿sí? Ok. Number seven. Number seven. Do you like music? Yes, I do. Or yes, I do. Esta es el, la clase del miércoles. De esta semana. Number eight. What do you do in the morning? Take a shower, eat lunch, or pre prepare my dinner, my, my supper. ¿Qué hago en las mañanas? ¿Me baño? ¿Como el almuerzo? ¿O preparo mi cena? ¿Ok? Good. Number nine. Instructions. It says, look at the picture. Aquí es donde anda Cristian. Cristian se le adelantó un poquito más. <ríe> Esta es la, la, la clase del jueves, ¿verdad, Cristian? Quiero ver. No, la yeah. clase del viernes. Del viernes es. Yes. Esta es la clase del viernes. Yes. Entonces, aquí están los dibujitos. Y dice, number one, he... Takes a shower, wakes up, or shaves. ¿Qué es lo que está haciendo este señor en primero? Se está bañando, se está despertando, se está rasurando. Wake up. Ok. Luego el número dos, hasta con el celular está en el baño ahí. Ok. He brushes his teeth, takes a shower, or shaves. Está lavando. Yo take a shower. Ok. En número tres. 
Bruce the Tits. En number four, right? Entonces, yep. aquí mandamos la... Uh, ok. Aquí encontró usted un error, ¿verdad, Cristian? ¿Cuál era el error? Eh, en el dibujo que me aparecía eh, en mi curso, solo estaban los primeros dos dibujos. Ah, no se me desplegaban okay. las otras dos imágenes, por eso no lo identificaba. Ah, ok. Eh, bueno, a mí me parece aquí, mire, para desplegarlo, ¿ves? Ya lo hace un poco más grande, ¿verdad? Sí, ese fue mi error, no, no vi la, la opción de desplegarlo. Ok, muy bien. Sorry. Pero tranquilo, esta, esta es para el viernes. Gracias. Ya, todavía tenemos tiempito, ¿verdad? Ahí. Yes. Ok. La canción está excelente, teacher. Oh, ¿really? Hay una canción. <ríe> ah, ok. Pero no son las que yo le envío en el, al grupo, Mario. No. ¿Cómo no? La, la que envió de WhatsApp de... Enche. Ok, with no money in our accounts. Ok. Y la tarea 10, que está también es para el viernes. Es para el lunes, pero nosotros la vamos a terminar el viernes. ¿Yes? Para poder mandar la unidad 2 a Insafor. ¿Qué es esta? ¿Ven? Fácil, eso de tomar una opción. ¿Yes? Ok, good. Hoy sí estamos ubicados en la plataforma, ¿verdad, chicos? ¿Yes? Pero la, la que me urge a mí, porque algunos me la han terminado, ¿verdad? Es la unidad 1. ¿Ya es? Porque ya, ya tuvimos que haberla enviado el viernes. Todavía estamos ahí debiendo, ¿verdad? Ok. Good. Now let's continue with the class. Let's continue with the class. Híjole, pero ya me borró toda la información de Dago. <risa> Vamos a ver si me acuerdo. Ok. Vamos a ver qué tan buena memoria tengo. Let me see. First name, Francisco, right? Francisco. Last name is Dagoberto. Eh, last name, aquí soy malísimo. What's your last name, Dago? Monteagudo. Monteagudo. Oh, yes. Mont Monteagudo. <laughs> yes. Occupation. Salesperson. Salesperson. Eh, vamos a ver si me acuerdo. Uldier Estrada, right? B. Uldier. B. Ah. Uldier. Uldier. Right? Uldier sí. Estrada. Good. En Workplace, laboratorios. Eh, pasa. No, I don't remember. Laboratorio Infasa. Infasa. <laughs> Laboratorio Infasa. Okay, good. Thank you, Dagoberto. Now, Marlon, the questions are for you, Mario. Marlon, ready? Okay, teacher. What is his first name? Marlon. No, no. Your first name, no. Dago's first name. Dagoberto. Um, yes. What is his first name? His first name is Francisco. What is his middle name? Dagoberto. Good. What is his last name? Monteagudo. What is his, his occupation? Um, your occupation is... No, his, his, his occupation. occupation. His occupation. Uh, his, his occupation is salesperson. Good. And what is his boss's name? His boss's name is Javier Estrada. Good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, and what is his workplace, Marlon? Um, his workplace is um, Laboratorios Infasa. Okie dokie. Thank you very much, Marlon. Now? You're going to make the same question, but to maybe. Me le va a hacer las mismas preguntas, pero maybe. Yes? Marlon, ready? Okay, I am ready. And I will copy. I will be your secretary, Marlon. The secretary. Maybe, are you ready? And, and then you ask the, okay, good. Ready, maybe? Hi, maybe. Are you ready? Yeah. Maybe. 
There are any person here? No, okay. So Otmar, so Otmar. Osmar. Otmar, ah, Otmar. Osmar, what is his first your, name? No, your, your. Your, your. Uh -huh. What is your first name? My first name is Otmar. Okay, thank you. Continue, Marlon, continue. What, what is uh, your middle, uh, middle name? Josue. Oh, thank you. What is your last name? No, 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 Josue. Oh, so excuse me, excuse me, Omar. <laughs> excuse me. Que oso, que oso. Josue, okay, good. What is your last name? Last name, my last name is Mendizabal. Oh, interesting, Mendizabal. Ah, it's not common, like Monteagudo, Mendizabal. It's not common. Uh, right? What is your occupation, Mr. Mendizabal? Este, aquí si no, no estoy muy seguro porque soy asistente técnico. Entonces no sé cómo se dice. Technical assistant. Technical, Technical assistant. Oh. Interesting. Uh, what is your boss name? The boss. My, my boss name is Eduardo Martel. Excellent. What is uh, your workplace? Is correct, teacher? My yes, patient. yes, correct. Workplace. You can say, what is your workplace or where do you work? Mm -hmm. uh, where do you work, Mr. Mendizaba? Mm -hmm. Martel Consultore. Oh, excellent. Martel Consultor Consultores. Okie dokie. Thank you very much. Thank you, Marlon. Thank you, Otmar. Now, Otmar, you make the question to Yancy and we finish. Yancy, are you ready? Sí, teacher. Okie dokie, <laughs> now. Otmar, make the question. Mm -hmm. What is your first name? Yancy. What's your middle name? Elizabeth. And your last name? Alvarez. Okay, thank you. What is your occupation? Occupation. Ordenanza. Janitor, right? Mm -hmm. okay. What is your boss name? Freddy Alfaro. What you for workplace? Ayala y Alfaro Security. Mm. Sorry. Ah, no me sale el símbolo. De... <laughs> Ayala y Ayala. No, bueno, sorry, no me sale el símbolo de. So, I'm sorry, Yancy. So, and, and Ayala Security. Ayala y Alfaro Security. Ah, Alfaro. Sobre, si son los chambres, va. Alfaro Security. Ok. Thank you. Ayala en Alfaro Security. Ok. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Very good. Now let's continue, right? Let's move on. Let's move on. Ok. Let's go to page. Number okay, page number uh, I can see 17, right? Page 17. Good. Now, here you're going to do something, right? You are going to copy the name of your classmate and the occupation of your classmate. So, you're going to make two questions. Listen, what are the two questions? 
the two question is, what's your name? What's your name? And the occupation is, what do you do? Si no se pueden, ¿cómo se dice su nombre, eh, su ocupación en inglés? Cuando regresemos al, a la clase de todos juntos, vamos a aprender a decir, ¿ok? Like technical assistant, for example, right? You know? Ok. So, you are going to make the same question to your group, right? We're going to make the merry go round. Vamos a hacer la rueda de caballitos, ¿ok? Now, ¿ready? Eh, it's not necessary you make the screenshot. No, no es necesario que hagan la, la captura de, de pantalla. Solo, what's your name and what do you do? What's your name? What do you do? Right? Ok, vamos a los grupos entonces. Ok. Group number one, Brian, Claudia, Francisco Dagoberto, Glenda, Griselda, and Yancy. Brian, Claudia, Dago, Glenda, Griselda, and Yancy. Group number one. No se les olvide su grupo. Group number two. Eh, Jorge, solo está oyente, ¿verdad? Mario Ernesto, Mario Neftalí, Marlon en Otmar. Group number three. Cristian. Ah, ok. <ríe> ya entendí por qué Cristian me hacía la pregunta, porque Cristian tiene tres nombres. Ajá, Emerson Josué, interesante, Cristian, interesting. Ok, Daisy, Crisia Carolina, Marcela, en Saúl. Bueno, aquí tienen dos oyentes. Quiero... No, no solo Saúl está de oyente. Yes. Entonces tenemos a, a Cristian, Cris, Daisy, Crisia Carolina, en Luis, en Marcela, right? Ok, I will repeat the instructions. You are going to make the question, what's your name and what do you do? What's your name, what do you do? Y vamos a hacer la rueda de caballitos, por ejemplo. Eh, Cristian le va a preguntar a Daisy, Daisy a Carolina, Carolina a Marcela y Marcela a, a Cristian otra vez, ¿ok? A, a cerrar el círculo. Pero todos copiamos. The name and the occupation. Ready? Ok, here we go. Cloud, a mí me sale, a mí me sale, empiezo con Claudia y después seguimos el círculo, no sé. Mm, sí, bien que sí. Bueno, what do you name? Claudia Orellana. What do you do? Mm, cleaning assistant. Oh, no. <ríe> Espérame. Este... Ah, sí, ¿verdad? ¿En español? ¿En español? <ríe> ¿Hola? ¿En español? No es que tenemos que decir el nombre y después la ocupación. Ajá, what's what your name? Uh -huh. Ajá, Claudia Orellana. What do you do? Cleaning assistant. Creo que sí. Sí, así era. Es que sí, creo que sí era, ¿verdad? El, 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 la ocupación. Sí. ¿O no era la ocupación? ¿Cómo no? Sí. ¿Yes? <ríe> oh, sí. Permítame. Vaya, ahora quien pregunta. Claudia, ¿you? Hola. Usted pregunta, you ask. Oh, yo pregunto. Wow. Yes. Eh, what's your name, Glenda? No, 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 no. You made the okay, question. Okay, the occupation. To... 
Uh -huh. You make the question to Jan, C, Brian, Dago, or Griselda. Ah, ok. Um, pero entonces tendría que preguntarle la ocupación de un solo o solo el nombre. The name, the name. What's your name, Jan, C? My name is Jan C. Alvarez. Copy, copy. Ok, Claudia, continue, continue, Claudia. No me recuerdo cómo. What do you do? What do you do or what is your occupation? What is your occupation? Or you can say, what do you do? What? What is your occupation? Um, cleaning yes, assistant. Mm -hmm. Or oh, janitor, right? Janitor. Janitor. Mm -hmm. Copy. Janitor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, continue, continue. Lo dejo un ratito, me voy al grupo dos, okay? Finish. No finish, teacher. No. Oh, continue, no continue, 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 continue. Uh, Ernesto, remember, remember Ernesto, Jorge, you... Jorge is listener, right? Jorge is listener, no participation. Only listener. Okay, okay. okay, 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 okay. Only, only Mario Ernesto, Mario Neftalí, Omar and Marlon. Okay. Okay. Uh, Ernesto, uh, what, do you, what do you do? Uh, is administrator. Okay. I analyze of credit. Excuse me. Repeat, please. I am my analysis of credit. Okay. Ah, Saúl, you can participate. Entonces sí puede participar, Saúl. Que hay mucho ruido aquí. Ah, ok. <risa> <risa> ya participó, ya me lo hicieron participar a Saúl. <risa> ok, a la fuerza. ¿verdad? Okay. Pero no veo el nombre de Saúl. Saúl Barrera. Computer analyst, is that right? Computer analyst. Computer. Yo tenía un... Brian. What do you do? Uh... Hello, Carolina. Do you have a question? Ya, ya me había, ya me había ayudado Cristian, pero quería confirmar. Mi, mi puesto es supervisora de, te, de atención al cliente. Sería supervision o manager. Okay. Supervisor. Supervisor, perdón. Your, the, the, your full occupation is uh, customer service supervisor. Ah, customer okay. service supervisor, but in general, supervisor. Supervisor, okay. Eso es, gracias. Like, like, like Christian, right? Chris is administrator, no? What, what's not manager? Ah, ma manager is manager, yes. Manager. So you're a manager, Chris. Gerencia, jefatura. Ah, uh -huh, yes, manager. Manager is correct, yes. Okay. Manager. Mm -hmm. But between supervisor and between uh, a manager is not the same. Mm, it could be, for example, we, I am supervisor and my my boss, my manager is a supervisor too. So we say supervisor, manager, jefe de supervisores. Ah, okay. It's a possibility. Okay. It's a possibility. It's a possibility. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome.
Because of the time, tick tac tick tac. we're going to make this very fast, right? So we're going to continue with the next exercise. Next exercise, right? Okay. Um, como ya nos comió el tiempo, eh, ese ejercicio lo vamos a hacer juntos, yes? Let me see. Just this, this exercise together, right? Okay, good. There is a mistake, error in every sentence. We are marketing manager. What is the correction? Volunteers, please. For number one. We are. We are. We are. Marketing managers. Right? Okay. Number two. She are in Margarita Marroquín. What is the correct? She isn't. She isn't. Margarita Marroquín. Okay. Margaret Marroquín. Natalia and Sarai is the new supervisors. Are the new. Are the are. Natalia and Sarai are, are the they? new supervisors. Okay. My boss are Jorge Sandoval. My boss my is, is my boss is Jorge Sandoval, right? Okay. Their secretary Aren Laura Miranda. What is the correct sentence? It's not. My, their secretary is not, it's right? Not. Their, their secretary isn't Laura Miranda. Okay, very good. Now, repeat after me, please. We are marketing managers. She is in Margarita Marroquín. Natalia and Sarai are the new supervisors. My boss is Jorge Sandoval. Their secretary isn't Laura Miranda. Okay, class. Now let's go to the presentation for today. The presentation for today. Okay, today is class number five. Today is November the 6th and vocabulary practice, right? Talk about what me and other people do in different workplaces and say our occupation, right? Now, talking about occupations. Here we have some occupations. I need you circle Circle the, the occupation. For example, number one, firefighter. Number two, cashier. Right? Okay, please. Uh, here we have cashier, right? Cashier. Mm -hmm. Doctor, very good. Continue, please, continue. Lapicito, lapicito, please. Demole click a lapicito. What is it? Okay, in the, in the bar, in la barra de herramientas, 
aparece un lapicito donde dice anotar, anotar. Me le dan clic ahí. Y ahí hay varias opciones. En la barra aparecen varias opciones. Aparece otro lapicito. Y ahí pueden darle clic a un, a, un a un rectángulo que está ahí, ¿no? Aparece un rectángulo, ahí donde está el, el lapicito y ahí podemos manchar. ¿Yes? Teacher, correct, teacher. Teacher. What else? Vendor, yes, vendor, right? Vendor. Nurse. Correct, we have nurse. Uh, let me see this. Painter, correct, painter. And this is salesperson, correct, salesperson. Salesperson. Plumber, correct. Only florist is missing. What is florist? What is the florist? Ah, oh, okay, very good cool. florist, right? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now let's check it out. The next one. Okay, good. Occupations, occupations. Now let's continue. How to use the verb to be in singular, right? I am an, contraction, I'm an. Negative, I'm not gen, I am not gen, contraction, I'm not gen. Then, you are an architect, you're an architect. Negative, Affirmative, contraction, negative, with his, she is, right? So here, in, in summary, we have the use of the verb to be in singular. Affirmative and negative. Contractions and no contraction, right? Questions? Affirmative and negative, right? Look. Affirmative contraction. Now, let's make this exercise, please. Ana Maria is in class. Ana Maria? No, okay. So, Brian, please. She is a banker. She's a banker. You are a student. What is the contraction, Brian? Brian, what is the contraction for you are a student? Okay, Claudia, please help me. What is the contraction for you are a student? Hello? You're a student. You're a student, right? Very good. Your a student, correct? He is Victor. Uh, Chris, number three. Contraction, please. He's Victor. He is Victor, correct. Thank you. I am an athlete. Daisy, I am an athlete. Contraction. Mm. 
mis castellanos. Ok, eh, so help me please. Eh, give me a second. Um, Glenda, please help me, Glenda. I'm, I, I am not like, eh, but I am, sería, I'm an athlete. I'm an athlete. Good. Number five, please. Number five is for eh, Griselda, please. Monica is an actor. Monica's an actor. Monica's an actor. Correct, right? So repeat us to me, please. Repeat us to me. Contraction and not contraction, right? Ooh, sorry, Daisy. Siga intentándolo. Please. Okay, very good. Repeat after me, please. She is a banker. She's a banker. You are a student. You're a student. He is Victor. He is Victor. I am an athlete. I'm an athlete. Monica is an actor. Monica is an actor. Okay, very good. Now let's continue, let's continue. Now we have examples of negative statement using the verb to be, right? I am not Natalie, I'm not Natalie. Contraction and no contraction, right? Okay. You're not a secretary, you're not a secretary. He is not an engineer, he's not an engineer. She's not a floor manager. She is not, she's not a floor manager, right? Okay, here we have the general view. And now in this case is for plural. Remember in this, we say a singular, right? Singular, I am, you are, he is, and she is. Now in this case is plural. We, you, in this case is ustedes, right? You and they, we, you, and they. Affirmative. We are photographer, for example, and contraction. We're photographer. And in negative, right? We're not chef, we're not chef, or we aren't chef. Okay? That's it, right? The general view of this. Now it's time to, to make an exercise. Look. Contraction. He's an engineer. Contraction for we are teachers. Please, I need your help. Uh, uh, Carolina, please help me, Carolina. What is the contraction for we are teachers? What are teachers? We are teacher, right? We are teachers. Teacher. Thank you very much. Next one, please, uh, Marcela. No, we are not. Contraction? No, we're not. Uh, contraction? No, we're not. Mm, we are not, right? Or we can say, no, we. Aren't. We aren't, right? No, we aren't. Thank you very much. Now, who's next? Mario Ernesto, right? Mario? 
Number four. They are not artists. Contraction. They are not artists. They're not artists. Or they are not. They aren't, right? Yes, aren't, aren't. Artists. Good. This is the way we can make contraction. Now, who's next? Mario, please. Number five, Mario. I am a student. Contraction? I'm a student. Ah, sorry. I'm a student, right? Okay. Thank you very much, Mario. Now, uh, Marlon, number six, please. She's a chef. She's a chef. Very good. She's a chef. Okay, okay. Now, please listen and repeat. Listen and repeat after me. He's an engineer. He's an engineer. We are not. Sorry. No, we are not. No, we're not. No, we aren't. They are not artists. They're not artists. They aren't artists. I am a student. I'm a student. She is a chef. She's a chef. Okay, questions about contractions? Do you have any question about contractions? No. No questions? Okay, okie dokie. Now let's continue, let's continue. Good. Now, in this exercise, we are going to say contraction his, she's, or their. His, she's, or their, right? Plus the preposition from. For example, I can say Mr. Sanchez is uh, from, I don't know, Cujucuyo, Santana, right? <laughs> okay. Oh, the example here, Miss Miss Tomiko Matsuda. She is from Hamamatsu, Japan. Hamamatsu, Japan. <laughs> okay, Tomiko Matsuda. Now, what about Miss Berta Solis? Mr. and Mrs. Franks. Hevelberg. Hi, hey, hi, hey, Donkey. Okay. Uh, Mr. George Candle. Mr. Mari Melon. In Spanish, is something like Maria Melon, right? But <laughs> Mari Melon. Okay, and Mr. Jake Hill and Miss Betty Parker. And Mr. Q Jin Wen from Wuhan, China. Okay. Good. And Mr. Norbad Jack, I from Egypt, right? So 
you're going to say the subject, the contraction, and the preposition from. Okay? Now let's make groups. Vamos a trabajar en grupos, chicos. Make a screenshot. Aquí sí tenemos que hacer una captura de pantalla, please. Screenshot. Please. Yo tengo problema con tomar el screenshot. Ok. Eh, ¿Será el teléfono o en la computadora? que? Es eh, la computadora la que no, no me permite. No sé qué eh, le pasa. ¿Qué le pasa a esa computadora, pues? Eh, <risa> fíjese que en mi computadora es una, es una HP. En la esquinita solo le aprieto una que dice screenshot. O hay una herramienta. Váyase, ya le voy a decir. Vamos a minimizar acá la, la presentación. Permítame un segundito. Vaya, usted se va al menú donde dice buscar. Y ahí le aparece una herramienta que se llama herramientas de recortes. ¿Ya sí? Ahorita eso está bien. Vaya, ahí le da clic. Y le aparece la opción donde dice nuevo. En la esquina izquierda. Nuevo, dice. ¿Ya? Cuando no, le aparece, me sale. no le da. No. Vaya, otra vez, permítame. Es que a la par del, del símbolo de Windows. Aparece un cuadrito donde dice buscar, Jancy. Aquí ya. Ajá, ok. Va. Entonces, dele clic ahí en buscar. Ajá. Le van a aparecer varias herramientas. Me es... dijo en nuevo, ¿verdad? No, sí. sol, solo dele clic ahí, nada más. Clic. Recorte. Le va a aparecer Ajá. recorte. Recorte. Vale, sale herramientas de recortes. Ahí dele clic. Ajá. Y ahí me sale nuevo modo y Ajá, nuevo. Eh, Dele en nuevo. Ahorita Ajá. le voy a dar para compartir, permítame. Okay. Cuando le den nuevo, le va a aparecer una opción de circular. Circular. Entonces viene usted y encierra todo el. ¿Sí? Uh -huh. quiere ver. Encierra todo lo que quiere guardar y ahí le va a quedar. Lo guarda o lo deja ahí activo para poder participar. ¿Sí pudo, Yancy? No, no me da. No le da. Bueno, voy a, voy a intentarlo yo aquí, pero me tengo que salir de mi pantalla, permítame. Ahí está, permítame. Uf, uh -huh. lo es. Vaya, lo voy a hacer yo, mire. Permítame, quiero ver si se lo estoy compartiendo. Sí, no, no lo estaba compartiendo. Ahorita voy a compartirlo. Vale, lo voy a hacer yo, mire. A ver si alcanza a ver en mi computadora. Okay. Le doy buscar. Le doy herramienta de recorte. Y me aparece nuevo. No sé si ustedes van a alcanzar a ver ahí. Y entonces mm. vengo yo y circulo. ¿Ve? No, no se ve. No se ve. No. Ay, qué lástima. Y ahí me eh, no sé si alcanza a ver la imagen. No. Sí, la imagen, sí. Ah, pero la imagen que yo recorté. Ah, no, esa no. Mm, bueno, qué que, que lástima, pero es que... Sí, ¿Entendés? pero es que no sé por qué no puedo tomar screenshot. Ajá, pero con ese recorte puede hacerlo. Vaya, vamos a hacer una cosa. Quiero ver si se los puedo mandar yo al, al, por mensaje. O, o ya sé quién, Ma, Mario, experto en esto. Es que ahí ya lo mandaron a los mensajes, teacher. Ah, vaya, entonces ya lo tenemos. <risa> sí, ahí ya lo mandó Glenda, me parece que lo envió. Vaya, entonces ahí con el mensaje nos vamos a dirigir entonces, ¿ok? Good. Entonces okay. vamos a hacer los grupos. Let's make the group. Ready? Ok. Eh... Group number one, ready? Griselda, Marcela, Mario Ernesto, Mario Neftalí, Marlon Enotmar. Ah, equipo pesado. Yes. 
Group number two. Claudia, Cristian, Dagoberto, Carolina, and Yancy. And group number three. Brian, Daisy, Glenda. Uh, no, pero vamos a tener que, que pasar a, a Mario. Vamos a poner a Mario en el grupo tres porque fíjese, Mario, que, que tengo dos oyentes en ese grupo. Bueno, teacher. Ahí me, me echa la mano con el grupo tres. Entonces, nuevamente, grupo número uno, Griselda, Marcela, Mario Ernesto, Marlon y Otmar. Grupo número dos, Claudia, Chris, Dago, Carolina y Jancy. En grupo número tres, Brian, Daisy, Glenda y Mario. Jorge y Saúl están de oyente ahí, ¿verdad? Por favor, solo van a estar escuchando. Ok, ready? Here we go. They are no, in Germany. Aquí creo que es they they are. Entonces es they apostrofe r they Berlin and Berlín, porque son dos personas, supuestamente. Pero es en el, en el 3, ¿verdad? En el 3, sí. Ajá. They, they are. They are. Sí. Para, vamos para la 4, ahorita es Mr. George Candle. Mr. George, George Candle. Ah, Grand, yes. Candle, ¿verdad? Este, yo, sí, es el mismo. Uh -huh. Entonces, he's from. Sí, he's from. Victoria, Canadá. He's, así es. He's. 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 He's from. Victoria. Y la cinco, ¿quién me ayuda ahí? En, no, mire. Es Mary Mello. 
She's from, ¿verdad? She's from. She's from. She's from. Mary. Mel. Ahí está. Ahí está en los mensajes la imagen, Claudia. ¿En cuál mensaje? Eh, ¿Ah? Tienda la envió ahí a los mensajes, ahí está en el chat. In the chat, in the chat. No me sale. In the chat, Claudia. Ay, no, the chat. no tengo el screen. No, no me sale. Bueno, me voy a buscar en otro lado, voy a ver si la, tal vez en mi teléfono. Bueno, es que no, no, no aparece porque solo nos aparece el chat de nuestra sesión. Ajá, Ajá, no el no, general. Tengo... Ajá, cabrón. Vaya, este, lo, yo quería compartirla, pero no. Ay, se compartiendo el profesor. Ah, okay. Gracias. Okay. Vaya, este, creo que en la segunda tendría que ser eh, she's she's from she's from o oh, sí porque creo que solamente habla de ella sí sí tercera sería they're from, they're from. Cuarta. Sería exactamente ellos, ¿verdad? Ellos son de... La cuarta, no. De... No, la cuarta. La cuarta es MR... de una persona. MR es hombre. Sí, MS es, es mujer. His. Sí, his. His. La cuarta es his. Um, la quinta, igual, ¿verdad? Eh, ver? Ah, no, es una mujer, ¿verdad? Sí. Eh, sería ella, sería she's. Sí. She's from, siempre she's, she's from. from. She's from. Mm -hmm. En la sexta, serían dos personas, sería, eh, quiero ver, de. They're from. They're from. They. En la, en la séptima sería una sola persona y es un hombre. Es his. Sí. His from. Y en la octava es una mujer. Sí. sí. Es una sola. Es she's. Uh -huh. Sí. Bueno. ¿Qué habrá pasado? Ay, ya Hi, good evening. Hello, are you ready for the tamalitos? Yes, right? Okay, good. <laughs> Number one. <laughs> Miss Tomiko Matsuda, chief from Hamamatsu, Japan. Group number one, please. Miss Berta Solís. Group number one. Miss Berta Solís. Miss Berta Solís. She's from Monterrey, Mexico. Okay. She's from Monterrey, orale. Mexico, yes. Group number two. Mr. and Mrs. Franz Hedelberg. Group number two. They're from. They're from. They're from, right? Berlin. Good. Berlin is the capital of Germany, right? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, good. Mr. George Crandall, group number three, please. He's from Victoria, Canada. He's from Victoria, Canada. Good. Victoria is a city of Canada. What is the capital city of Canada, class? Montreal. Montreal, no. No, no, no. Ottawa. 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 It's a native uh, name, right? Ottawa. Good. Group number one, please. Miss Mary Mellon. She's metal outside. She's from. She's from. She is from Melbourne, Australia. Uh, what is the capital of Australia? Sydney. Sydney, no. Canberra. Melbourne. No, Canberra. Ah, Canberra. Canberra. Canberra is the capital, yes. Okay, Mr. J. Hill and Miss Betty Parker. Group number two, uh, group number two please. Group number two. They're from Los Angeles. Sorry? They're from Los Angeles. They're correct. They're from Los Angeles, California, United States, right? Mr. Q. Jing Wen from Wuhan. Aquí donde inició el, el coronavirus, ¿verdad? Wuhan. In China. Good. So, uh, group number group number three, right? Group number three? Is from. Mr. Is, is, is a man. Uh -huh. He is from. Wuhan, China. Okie dokie. And finally, Miss Norbachat. Group number one, please. She's from. She's it's a woman, right? Miss, Miss. She's. She's from Cairo, Egypt. Egypt, right? Good class. Repeat us to me, please. She is from Hamamatsu, Japan. She is from Monterrey, Mexico. They're from Berlin, Germany. He is from Victoria, Canada. She is from Melbourne, Australia. They're from Los Angeles, United States. He is from Wuhan, China. She is from Cairo, Egypt. Egypt. Okay, class. Very good. Any question? Now, let's see. Uh, I will take the attendance and you say good night. But before, let me see. I will stay 10 minutes with a student. One to one, right? Me ayudan porque tengo una mala memoria. Eh, la semana pasada me quedé con Daisy, ¿verdad? Daisy? Yes. Yes, ok, thank you. Veamos. Eh, Brian. ¿Se puede quedar esta noche, Brian? No veo Brian. Mm -hmm. Bueno, entonces se iría Dagoberto. Hello, Dago. ¿Es ok? Hey, can you stay 10 extra minutes after the class? Yes. Yes. Thank you very much. Good. Now, let's take the attendance, please. Uh, Claudia? Claudia? Present. Okay. See you Hola. tomorrow. Yeah. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Have a good night. Thank you. Chris? Here. Okay, thank you. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Daisy? Present. Okay, bye-bye. Dagoberto? Present. 
Ok, no se me va a ir, Dagoberto. Yes. Glenda. Present. Ok, bye bye. Have a good night. Bye. Bye bye. Griselda. Present. Good Thank night. you. Good night. Jorge. Present. Ok, bye bye. See you tomorrow. Josué. Carolina. Present. Ok, see you tomorrow. Goodbye. Eh, bye bye. Marcela. Have a good night. You too. God bless you. Thank eh, you. Ernesto. Present teacher. Bye bye. See you. See you tomorrow. Take care. Eh, Mario. See you tomorrow, teacher. Good bye you. <coughs> Have a good night. Marlon. Thank you. Marlon. Here I am, teacher. Thank you very Have much. Good good you too. Maybe. Otmar. Present. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Saúl. Good night. Good night. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Jancy. Good night, teacher. Have a good night. God bless you. Okay. Hi, Dago. It's a pleasure. Hi, teacher. Okay, what is your opinion of the class? Do you like it? Yes, I like it. Oh, good, good, good. Have you these English courses before? Or is the first time? It's your first experience? No, I have uh, a class when I was in the high school. Ah, okay. After, nice. after the normal class, mm -hmm. I I don't know what, how do you say, but... That's okay. So you have a course, a course. Yes. After yes. the high school. And where did you study, Dago? Where did you study? I study in the Instituto Nacional Joaquín Ernesto Cárdenas. Ah, okay. So after Joaquín Ernesto Cárdenas, you finish and then you... You used to go to the English class, right? Okay. Yes, so, but so in, for, the, in the same. Ah, in, in the, the same, same institution. Class. In the same institution. Yes. Ah, I understand. Good, good, nice. So I see that you, you are a good participant. You understand. So congratulations thank and thank you for your participation because the participation is very important in this class. Very important. Yes. Okay, uh, but that will, do you have any question about any topic for the moment? The alphabet, the possessive adjectives, the verb to be? No, I am not. No. I understand. Everything is clear. Yeah. Uh, because I I have a um, middle medium level. Uh-huh. Okay, good. Yes, but... I know. I know that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you want to review, quiere repasar, right? You, you want to review yes, the, yes. the because basics. Because I was studying in, uh, 15 years ago. 15? No, yes. Dago. How old are you, Dago? I see you're like 24. Uh, uh, 30, I am 32. 32? 32. Uh -huh. Yes. Wow, well, you look very young. You look very young. You look like 25 the most. Lo más que le calculaba unos 25, right? <laughs> yeah, nice. <laughs> nice. Okay, Dago. Now, the next level, the next unit, unit number two, we are going to check the simple present, right? The simple present is very important, but sometimes it's complicated. You know that Mario was saying that uh, uh, Mario went to unit two. So in unit number two, we are going to make an exercise that is like I say, uh, not very easy, but not very, not very difficult, right? That you are going to comp right. to make sentences. Basically, it's subject, verb, and complement, right? But it, this is for unit number two. Good. But before I finish, I want to give you some some suggestions, uh, Dagoberto. Number one, if you want to learn English, right? You need you have a a compromise with English. Right. In this moment, you are you have the obligation to practice every day. 
every day, right? at least five, 10 or 15 minutes every day, it's absolutely yeah. necessary. And there are many forms that you can practice. Today is very easy. You don't have excuses to say, no, I don't practice, I can't, you know, come on. You have a lot of resources, right? For example, do you have a, an app in your television like Netflix, HBO, Disney? Yes, I have. What, what do you have? Netflix. I, I have uh, Netflix. Oh, good. Nice. So, Dago, my recommendation is that you watch movies full English. Uh, today, today I was thinking about, about it. Okay, good. So, please, uh, project yourself and you say, I will watch one movie every week. One movie every week, Dago. Understand? Okay. It's not necessary yeah. you say ah tonight because ah oh, I, I work, uh, I have the English class, right? So maybe you can watch uh, uh, 20 minutes, 40 minutes, etc. Et but the idea is to complete the full movie, right? And my recommendation is because this is basic that you watch cartoons. Cartoon like, for example, uh, Shrek, Toy Story, uh, I don't know, um, Sing, Pets, no, etc., etc. Cartoons, películas de muñequitos, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And also, one of the resources that I recommend is the music. I say music because... I like the music in English. Uh-huh. Uh, Look at me, uh, Dago. I am from the 80s, <laughs> from the 80s, from the 90s, right? So for me, this music is very, very nice. I like it. And 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 it's more, how can I say? It's, it's better because it's, it's not difficult, not difficult to understand. So uh, I used to learn one song every week too, right? Me solía aprender una canción cada semana, me long time ago so that's the way i learned with music so because it worked with me you know me funcionó so i make the recommendation for for my students so dago okay. my recommendation is that you learn by memory if it, if it is possible right one song every week okay, okay. one movie okay. and one song every week November, December, January, February. Continue, 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 continue. Don't stop with music and videos, right? That's okay. my recommendation. Right. Also, okay. uh, in the group, Dago, uh, I am sending some videos. Monday, I send a video of vocabulary, right? For example, today I send a video about eggs. Did you see the video today? In the WhatsApp group? No. No. <laughs> okay, good. Try to watch. It is how to, uh, the vocabulary related with egg, right? Todo el vocabulario relacionado a los huevos. ¿Cómo se dice huevo estrellado, huevo hervido, huevo <laughs> revuelto, etc., etc.? Sí. It's vocabulary. Monday. Tomorrow, I will send another video with grammar. Mañana, Dago, le voy a enviar un video al, al grupo de WhatsApp, yes? Of grammar, right? Wednesday, a listen, right? Exercise. Eh, estoy mandando una serie de ejercicios, Dago, listening, right? That sí. are wonderful. They describe a story. En el, en, el, en el video les describe una historia, Dago, y luego le hace preguntas a usted. For example, they say, eh, what was the name of the person? ¿Cuál era el nombre de la persona? ¿En dónde estaba? And then you have to answer. Y usted tiene que ir respondiendo con el listen, right? Okay. En la clase hacemos varios ejercicios de listening, Dago. Sí. Yes? Good. ¿Le parecen difíciles? Uh, no, lo de la no. clase, por eso tal vez casi no, bueno, no me he puesto a verlo, apartar tiempo, porque he andado un poco ocupado, entonces yeah. no he apartado el tiempo para verlos, por eso. Porque, mm -hmm. pero, pero sí entiendo. Do you understand the class? La clase. Excellent. Sí. So in the next in the next level, um, I mean in the next unit, I will speak more English because 
Remember, it's basic. Some students are like, mm, because it's basic, right? But some students like you, Mario, uh, Saul, right? Uh, you are, like, I, I can say you, you like to participate more. That's, you know. But in some cases, in some other students, uh, it's the first experience. It's, it's su primera experiencia, right? So it's more difficult for them. So that's why I got, like, Sometimes English, sometimes Spanish, right? <laughs> okay, but in the next unit, more more English. So I hope you understand. Okay, and on Thursday, uh, for example, last week, I sent a song named Angel from the Rolling Stones. Le envié una canción que se llama Angel. No sé si la escuché alguna vez. Lago. Angie. Angie, huh? Angie. Uh, Angie. Creo que sí. Oh, Angie. Ajá, uh -huh, yes, ah, no, from sí. the Rolling ya Stones. Y el last week, la semana pasada, les envié esta canción, sí. Thursday. Entonces, los jueves les voy a estar mandando una canción para que se la aprendan, yes. And on Friday, I send a book. Okay. Todos los viernes les voy a estar enviando un audiolibro, yes, in the WhatsApp group. So, okay. eh, you listen to the, to, the, to the book and you practice. Simple like that, right? Okay, so every day. Okay, so please, Dago, try to to check those videos. They are not related with the class. No están relacionados con la clase, pero es material extra para que ustedes practiquen. Okay? So, I don't know if you have any extra question, Dago. Any extra question? No. No, no. For question. you, everything is clear, right? So I am happy for you because you understand everything. Clear. All clear. The verb to be is like, Mm, yes. Very easy, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dago, for the moment. <laughs> for the moment. <laughs> sí, okay, Dago. Moment. Thank you very much and thank you for your participation. Me ayuda mucho con su participación, eh? Yes. Okay, thank you. you. Okay, have a good night. See you tomorrow, right? Good night, teacher. Good night. God bless you.